Man, y'all know what it is. Y'all know what the fuck it ain't. Ask me and Rico in this motherfucker who might make movies. Bam Bam Kevo had surgery done to his body uh, to give him a six pack. Yeah. Right? Now, you called it, what did, what did you say? What was the word? He got his, he got his waist snatched. He got his waist snatched. Okay. He got his waist snatched. Talk to me about that, man. I, I, I'm not going to lie. I love your commentary on it. Appreciate it. Definitely thought it was uh, entertaining. Uh, talk to me about that. I just I just want to get your get your opinion on that, man. Do you feel like uh, do you feel like men should be able to get surgery done on their body Hell as no. well as women? Hell no, bro. Is that the case? If that's the case, he doing that. Is it? Would this nigga get a penis implant? Power? No, I ain't trying to say that. It's just what else would you do? But you know, I fucks with, like I said. People know all this already. You know, Kevin with just a mutual respect. The same I got with 16, same I got with all these other people I talk to behind the scenes. Well, it's, you know, I ain't gonna disrespect the man, but we, we, we bumped heads before too in the DMs. And we was able to see eye to eye and squash everything, especially, you know, it's a different type of level of threats and shit when you're rich and you a scammer, foe. I'm like, this nigga ain't finna buy my social security number, foe, and have me out here fucking up my credit while I'm working on it. But I heard, I heard you say that. Real shit. He said he, he, I don't know if it was checked you or disrespect. He said something to you, but in a rich nigga way. Rich, he, rich nigga threatened me, folks. What, what, what did you mean by that, though? Just, break that down. So what, what you mean by that? It's kind of like, yeah, man, I like what you're doing. I see what you're doing on YouTube and shit. But, you know, sometimes false information is about being stitched is how people die. Then he'll come in with, on both ends. <laughs> when you get mad, then you... Because right now it's like, okay, you mean you could die, like something could happen to the person you get, I'm talking about, and, and then, you know, it's just, bro brought up, he he just, he he brought up, you know, another blogger dying and shit, and then, see, yeah, I kind of threw that in there, then, kind of like, you moving right, and then just like, a threat with a compliment, or just like, I ain't going to do it, but this is what I hear happening. And then, that type of shit, like, this is what's going on. I know you know about it, <laughs> type of shit. And I'm just, damn, I'm steady getting mad. And then I'll just say, end it with this. I, I tell him, I'm like, man, if a nigga touch me, he gonna die. He said, question mark? <laughs> I said, okay. Maybe he wasn't threatening me, though. I said, damn, okay, maybe I just tweak. Because now I'm like, I ain't threatening him, but I'm just saying, if a nigga touch me, because this is the way I'm taking it, he gonna die. And then he question mark, I'm, um. Uh, what the fuck I must have said? I must have said something. Of anybody, I, I, then I took it away from... Now, you see, now he think I'm threatening him, like coming to him, but then I said some shit like, I'm just saying, if anybody on the streets think I'm just a blogger who not gonna protect myself, then that person gonna die. And he said, uh, and then he, instead of a heart, you know how you could double tap a motherfucking message? Uh -huh. He said it wasn't a heart, it was a credit card. <laughs> the nigga said it was a credit card, folks. So I said, damn, okay. I, then I, I read all the messages... Because we did all this in vantage mode. You know, I was finna send this shit to my girl. I screenshot it, send it to my. It told him I screenshot it, and he screenshot it too. I said, this nigga, man. But uh, I go back and read that thing. Um, he just really wanted me to, 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 to delete that video and talk about this video. And I ain't gonna get into the shit we talked about the, to do the video, but I'm like, okay, cool. Cool. I'm like, all right. And he been fucking with me, sending me information. He made sure he sent me all the paperwork. I had to skim through and all that shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? He, he just, but that Brazilian butt lift shit, bro, ain't cool. He can work for it. You big as hell, man, man. You big as fuck. He can do that shit naturally, folk. I think, I, I, I mean, to each his own, I just feel like uh, a lot of females like the belly. You know what I'm saying? Like, Some of them, like yeah. The belly, you know what yeah. What I don't have females that. They like me because I was I'm a I'm a smaller guy. You know yeah, what I'm yeah. Like a, a, a nigga with a little bit more meat on. You know so I don't know me personally. Yeah. I'm not doing it. Bah. I'm not gonna knock him for doing it. I still think it's funny. Yeah. I'm not gonna knock him for doing it. I don't know why he let the world know. Yeah, it must have been a sponsorship deal. That's another thing. Did he let the world know? Or did 16 say something before he, did he say something first or yeah. did 16 say something? I got it off his Instagram page, like when I, because I follow him, so First I. First time I seen it was in the blogs, the yeah, blogs mm. saying 16 did it. No, nah, it was on, no, nah, man, it was Ben Man Kevin on his page and he said, 
the where I couldn't get rid of this pain. I now I used to be six eighty, now I'm six twenty, and I couldn't do it. Woo, woo, woo. Yeah, I seen that post. And he, but people was like, "What? They, it had nothing to do with see people when like sixteen exposed you." He dropped the shit on his own, man. Had he had to get paid for it. I wouldn't have told the world though. I ain't gonna lie to you. I wouldn't have did it, but if I did, I wouldn't have told nobody. So you kind of touched on this earlier, but I'm gonna still ask you right now. Would you rather get your waist snatched, as you put it, that, snatched, or a dick implant? You gotta choose one. Which one would it be? I wouldn't need, man. I wouldn't do them motherfuckers, man. But you know, you know. I, I, you know, God bless me with what what all my height went to my third leg. So if I had, I wouldn't do neither. I'm gonna put, put it like that. I don't most definitely gotta do the other one, man. I don't know. I could do. I just can't see myself. It's like one of the questions. Like, would you do this to get shot in the head? Like, shot in the head. I can't see myself doing that. But like, why? You could go to the gym. Be so rich. Eat right. Work out for like. So do you think? All right. So I, I seen somebody uh, a couple of blogs touch on this. Basically about you know Batman Kevin was known for you know what I'm saying working out always preaching. Yeah. Working out educate not education working out fitness eating healthy healthy. But then you know when you come to find out that he actually you know had surgery done. Yeah. Do you feel like that's a slap in the face to the people that's actually looking up to him or the kids? And now the kids think that that's something that they could possibly do in the future. Instead of working out, I can just go buy me a six pack. This shit, that shit expensive. I don't think it must. you gotta have a lot of money to go buy you a six pack. But I, I, honestly, man, he put Jeff Bezos and all that other shit on his legs. I think he going in for that full mainstream sellout look image. I think he just embracing it. I did, and that. He Kevo, mentioned, he cool. Mentioned, uh, cool people still. Cool people. He mentioned his rich friends. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think he said something about his rich friends. I don't want to put words in his mouth, but he he, he did though. His rich friends or something, right? Yeah. Uh, and he said that other rappers do it. They just don't let y'all know. Do you think that other rappers do it? One. And do you think that your rich friends doing something? Should be the reason you do something. Even if sometimes you know, money can change people. A nigga can influence. Who knows how motherfucker act with million dollars? I know I wouldn't change and get, but I know I change a little habit. Who just knows how a million dollars, like actual cash after taxes, all that type of shit that you just set for life type money, you know. But honestly, with the rich friend shit, sometimes you pick up good benefits and good habits from their ass and shit, but. I know Kev I know Kevin Gates got it. Kanye West got it. He Kanye West admitted to it. I know Kanye West did, but I didn't know Kevin Gates. You could just tell some niggas' body sometimes. Okay. He he work cause you gotta work out with the shit. Kevin Gates might not have, just I'm just throwing that one out there. I know Drake. Drake got the shit. Drake why got the shit. Up? Why you say why you say Drake got the Drake, okay, so you think Drake got his waist snatched? He said something about it. Go Dr. Miami. Dr. Miami did this shit. No shit. Oh, yeah, he said, but it was like you know, subliminal, you know. like real shit. Look it up. And so that they doing it already, but you see what the rich people doing? Not telling people. Why is you telling the world, Ben Man Kevin, man? That's something like he want that image. Like with Young Thug with the dresses, not saying he gay or nothing, but when people do that, that's the image they want. They ready to embrace.